And jovial crab. How could that not be a great word? Uh, okay, so we got the jovial crabs. We've got the mothras up there. And we are on planet Skyving Angel. What is this? This looks like something I'd want to shoot. Titanium, uh, maybe not. There's a lot of gold just over there, though. Uh, I don't see anything of any standout interest. So I think we're going to go get back in. Ooh, ooh, trading post. Yeah, please. I've got a lot of stuff I'd like to trade, actually. Um, welcome to the Galactic Trade Network. I want to sell some stuff. Yeah, you can have the shield plate, the Gek charm, the Atlas Stone. No, I'm probably going to want to bring that with me, right? Uh, what else are we going to have? Uh, I'm trying to sell some of the stuff that I have on my ship, really. Let's uh, let's do some stuff for that. Okay, yeah, he'll buy the Gek charm and the Garagaga off of me. So that's pretty cool. Okay, not that any of those were an upgraded warp core, uh, which is a little bit unfortunate. What is that over there? Do you reckon that is... Oh, it's an iron deposit. Okay, I'm going to get back to my ship and then... Oh, wow, it's all the way up there. And then we're going to go see what we can find on this planet. Okay, this looks like somewhere we could uh, check out. Also, another one up there. It'd be nice to see what that's all about. Quite a diffuse building style. I mean, I suppose that's going to be quite a way to walk. Um, I, don't know, I don't know why... Why well, they wouldn't have a few buildings clustered together. I would definitely have a few buildings clustered together. And it, even if it's just one or two to give the impression that, you know, not everyone is a massive loner on this. Okay, give me some hyperdrive. Uh, recoil stabilization. That's no good. Uh, what have we got here? Hi. How are you doing? You are a transmission tower. Long ago, it seems, an automated distress signal went unanswered. If I can crack the encryption pattern, I could potentially extract the coordinates. I've actually faced this challenge before, and I'm not entirely sure, but I think it was 720, but I don't know why it is that. Yeah, yeah, I'm not sure why it was 720. Um, if anybody could explain that particular math puzzle to me, uh, it, it didn't seem to follow the pattern to get up to 720. I just, I don't know. I'm just not sure. Okay, we have discovered a crashed ship. Oh, really? Oh, okay, that might be worth going to check out. Let's go see what we find at a crashed ship site. It's so close, like 16 seconds away. I seem to have rolled my ship somewhat, but that's what happens when you spin around in space without having any sort of strafe controls. Do you, do you get the idea that maybe I would like some strafe controls here? It would kind of do me quite well. Okay, let's try and land as close as we can to this. Who knows what we are going to find here? It seems to be the rolling theme. Who does know what we're going to find? There is a smashed up ship. Is this better or worse than my ship? I don't know. It looks a bit bigger. Hey, have you got your own Atlas core around anywhere? Debris, let's have a look. There is a distress beacon coming from here, but maybe we'll get ourselves... The interior of Downcraft is a patchwork of technologies, possibly scavenged from multiple ships. The portly corpse of the dead beak's life form sprawls on the control panel. Clearly the deceased had a per chance for finer things in life. Aww. The cargo hold is secured by some kind of homemade security system. Like the rest of the ship, it is a mishmash of technologies. Deactivating it could be tricky. Let's search the pilot, because, you know, there's no way this is going to be a binary choice, right? A decomposed grub-like crustacean and an exosuit te tech provide... Pro yeah. I get some rewards. Yay. <laughs> Language not working well for me at the moment. So, did I only get the chance of doing one or t'other? Uh, obviously, I did. That is unfortunate, but, you know, we will live with it. And it's still more cannon damage. I mean, that's nice. Not really what I'm looking for. I love these blue plants here. Look at them. They're amazing. I've got to blow stuff up to get things from them, though. That's, that's a little bit unfortunate. Uh, okay, what are we going to do now? We're going to interact with that ship over there and see if we can fix it somehow. I believe this is kind of what we need to do. Uh, let's interact. Hi. What is going on? What what do you need to become working? Well, you're kind of all right, aren't you? Let's Let's do a compare. You're all right. You're not, you're not the best I've ever seen. Um, like this stuff's all broken this technology is critically damaged but can we swap this one no we cannot that's that's unfortunate okay so what do we need to, to fix it carbide sheets iron dynamic resonator now that one might actually be a little bit more difficult yeah, I have no idea how to build a dynamic resonator, so I'm not going to be able to fix this, unfortunately. But look at this lush bit of ground over here. I've not seen anything like this before. 
Oh, this is amazing. Can we have more of this, please? I would very much enjoy more of this. What is that? Is that is that a, a, a creature? Is that a, a plant? I, mean, I don't know. Is it... <laughs> Milfoy Humpadump? <laughs> I think maybe. I don't know. What what is this? Is it is it dangerous? Are you gonna try and have me? Can I jump on you? No, no, you, you don't you don't seem to care at all, do you? That, I'm not sure if that's unfortunate or not. That that is a thing. This is a thing as well. Okay, so in this stack of container bays, this is a new vi uh, new building as well. I've never seen anything like this before. Oh, this is lovely. I want to. I want to put my ship in here. Uh, okay, let's have a look inside. I haven't grabbed the waypoint. I, I didn't really see much point. There is a technology over here. There's a multi-tool technology that is nice, but not quite what I'm after. Nothing for my spaceship. Ah. Oh look, this one has a space pad. Am I going to be able to land on it? Probably not. It's really hard to land where you want to on this this game. Ah, you see, I, I thought I was going to overshoot, and I've come hideously undershot. But what is this guy going to have for it? This is quite a nice little uh, little area out here. Got a beacon set up. Oh, there's a storm rolling in. Uh, the computer did tell me there was a storm coming in, but it was nothing really to worry about. I've got to say, out of all the planets that I have discovered so far, I think this one is my favourite. Um, it feels real temperate and stuff, and just the whole... the the flora and fauna around here are amazing i'm trying to see if I, there's any creatures around to have a look at unfortunately not can we get some plutonium here that's good i'm doing a lot of taking off and landing so the plutonium is definitely needed bonjour sava yeah this guy seems cool hey man how you doing let's give a little chat to you assistant soyosta Friend Despair, Gek Trader, Bloody Blah, Gek Oxide. Um, thank with common oxides. I don't, I don't have oxides to thank with. Um, let, let's go and get some oxides, shall we? Okay. Do you reckon these give iron? These do give iron. That's much better. Okay. Four, six, eight, ten. Look at that storm. Just look at it. It is blowing a good one, isn't it? I like like the look of that over there. The one thing that a little bit annoying, like these back and forth, back and forth, big old blowy. What about these things? Do they not catch? Oh, what was that? Ah, uh, look at this one. Hey, how are you doing there? How much do you want for your spacecraft? Let's let's have a chat. Let's see what let's see what he says. Hey, how are you doing? You you look like a good chap. Welcome, friend. Starship something or other. Uh, make an offer on the starship. The storm is clearing 1.27. I'm a little bit of the way there. I'm a little bit of the way there. Okay, thank, thank you very much. I will be back for... I mean, this looks great. Look at it. That is great. Uh, okay, let's get inside and see if we can't give this... What's this? You see this little point floating in space here? Look, let me put my... There, right, right there. What's this about? Kind of jitters and moves a little bit. I don't know, I'm not sure. All right, hi. Let's try this again, shall we? Thank him with common oxide. Take some iron. The overjoyed trader pecks happily at my gift. It thanks me with its own generous offering. Hyperdrive? No. No, advanced cooling sigma, which we may or may not already have. Is that is that all the interactions I can do? I fed him some carbon. Let's see what happens when we feed him carbon. Hey, Lion Gek Federation, Fox Busa, Ukadang Courage Friend. Um. Hmm. Who? Are, I am a. Is this me? My current current Gek standing as partner. Is this, is this where we're at? Okay, the trader stares in my visor and clicks its beak in time with my breathing. I can only assume that it's supposed to make me feel welcome. Uh, I am going to go for the isotope. Trader agrees to help. Well, thank you very much, Mr. Trader. And we got some carbon. Well, I mean, that was nice of him. He didn't have to give me that, did he? What's this beacon about? Hey. Requires a bypass chip. We can bypass. Oh, look, there's another one of those floppy things. It's almost a beholder, you know? It's a crazy looking thing. Oh, our friend, uh, 
status standing has gone up. We are now friends. I thought we were friends anyway. What's this? Oh, it's the same, same part as that. Uh, so, to make it, I need to come to my exosuit because that's where we carry stuff that's important. Uh, bypass chip. Yes, please. Thank you. Alright, what are we going to ask this for? Monolith, Colonial Outpost, Transmission, or Shelter? I think we're going to go with the Colonial Outpost. Searching for Colonial Outposts. Go look in that direction. Okay, I will go look in that direction. Thank you very much. Six minutes away by foot, but that's not how we're going to travel. Okay, I'm going to first make this waypoint because, you know, I'd like to know where things are. So what will happen at this operation center? To be fair, I'm not sure. Is it not going to let me go any further closer to it? Just a little bit closer? Just a little bit more, please? I'm not sure why it suddenly stopped me here. Oh, this is a nice tidy base, isn't it? Everything's all like packed away and the things have got little uh, shelters over them and stuff. Okay, let's uh, go inside. Oh, I've got to destroy it. I can do this. I can do this. It's an X. And daka daka daka. This shouldn't take too long, hopefully. Yeah, thank you for telling me that my destination is reached. Ah, we've got to re refuel, of course. Refuel, recharge, reload. Where is he? There he is. We should be able to take this guy down. Should be able to take them all down, really. Let's try and get a little bit closer so we're not fighting from such a distance, trying to get an aim in from an impossible shot. Uh, he's inside. What am I supposed to do here? Okay, let's just carry on shooting the door then. So, I need to definitely increase the clip size of this weapon if I can. I'm not sure if that is actually something I can do. Uh, we will check when we get in through the door though, I think. Uh, two more clips, three more clips. This, this door is pretty tough. Okay, let's get inside. Throw the reload. I don't see much going on. This guy really wants to see me, but what is behind this door? It takes an atlas pass. Okay. How do we shut the uh, the alarm off? This would be a great thing to do. I don't think it's going to let me, though, unfortunately. Uh, this also needs an atlas pass. Ugh, disgusting. Disgusting. Uh, okay, I said we were going to have a look and see if we can... Short burst added. Uh, short rapid sequences of fire. Operates automatically. Okay. All right, let's... Um so we've got a couple of the beam intensifiers already. I'd really like to get the impact damage. No, no, we wanted the the reload. Unfortunately, there does not appear to actually be any. That is unfortunate. We can add the small plasma launcher, though. I mean, that, that would be fun, right? Let's do it. Thank you. Thank you. So let's, let's try and find it. Bolt caster... Oh, it's not letting me do stuff inside again. That's okay. All right, let's let's uh, let's see this and see what it's saying. It's an assembly center. The security alert is scrambled on the screen. Just chaotic jumble of words. There's just enough physical text to point me towards the right workflow and potentially bring the installation back online. Mmm. So, it's, it's saying something here. Script Aster docking. Now... Oh. Gek space station planetary trade for I mean like after docking comes a space station right previous user's workflow is restored the system comes back online I think I've got it right I think I've got it right we've got the phase coolant sigma though that's that's not quite what we're after but my standing with the Gek has increased somehow because you know that was important oh this thing is trying to beat me up I will not take that oh I pressed the wrong button uh, there's a mining beam. I don't want the mining beam. Is there two of them? All right, maybe I do want the mine. I'm gonna fly away. <laughs> uh, I cannot seem to change mining beam. Bolt caster. There we go. Is this better? Is this how we kill them? Go on, run away. Be gone with you. That one's dead. No. Wow, these these guys are tough. They eat carbon though. Let's reload. They're more incoming already. Is this what they're telling me? He is a circler. Okay, that's that guy down. Where's the other one? Hopefully he's forgotten about me. All right, we're going to fly on to another place and see what glories await.